A business owner in the Power and Light District went to work this morning only to find broken glass. You see it right there. These broke into the business. They took off with money, but it's no need to sound the alarm just yet. Just before 6 a.m., the peace and quiet was shattered. Along with this glass at the polished nail salon, here you see crews cleaning what's left. It happened just before the hustle and bustle of the downtown morning commute. Officers say someone busted the window, made their way inside, and took off with cash. For nearby businesses, it really hasn't heightened fears, only awareness. We have a really good downtown community down here, so we're just going to continue to be as aware as we've always been. Melissa Bullard works at the hair salon next door. They have a security camera, but it's facing inward. When asked about adding more surveillance, she says it's a possibility, but they aren't necessarily splitting hairs over it. We have never had an issue where we thought that we needed to um, put more security in place. Uh, this might change how we look at things. There have been a half dozen property crimes in this zip code within the last week. Officers haven't made an arrest in this latest case, but Bullard and others, they're convinced what happened here is the exception, not the norm. I don't, I don't feel any less safe being down here, considering what happened. Investigators say there is no surveillance video showing the actual break-in. So as of right now, they have no suspect description.